Hi everyone, I'm Christy Marsh, a communication major and photography minor at St. Vincent College. Hi, my name is Marian Emerson, a sophomore English major with a secondary education minor here at St. Vincent College. Hello, I'm Alyssa Johnstone, a sophomore psychology major at St. Vincent. In the spring of 2017, we went to Iceland with our college for a natural science course. While we were there, we saw a lot of amazing sights. Here, we'll show you a few. It wasn't until we left hiking the glacier that we all came to realize the effects that climate change have taken on Iceland. Without further ado, we present Iceland, Climate Change and Effect. Iceland, Climate Change in Effect. It's no secret that the world is seeing environmental changes across the earth. However, it does not go unnoticed that the consequences of climate change have dramatically impacted Iceland. In light of the shift in climate, Iceland's geological makeup has seen consequences that include melting glaciers, severe droughts, and extreme water shortages. These are a small aspect of the major damage that can be caused by climate change. Five of the largest ice caps, which are located in the south of central Iceland, are melting at a considerable rate, at least one point four inches per year. Glaciers are geological landmarks that are diminishing year by year. Icelanders have recognized the effect of climate change and are taking steps to slow the consequences already set in motion. By harnessing geothermal control, Icelanders have been able to create geothermal power, which reduces the carbon footprint humans leave behind when obtaining energy. Tourists can see geothermal plants in action when visiting the country, as Iceland wants to share the knowledge they've obtained in renewable power. Icelanders have pioneered this new environmental energy that can delay the damage climate change is making on the earth. Perhaps, if the rest of the world were to follow in the footsteps of Iceland's innovative energy design, together we could delay the destruction that climate change has set in motion. So how can you stop the effects of climate change? First and foremost, get involved. Send a message to your local government official. Let them know you want to see action to prevent climate change. Be energy efficient. Unplug electronics that are not in use. Change your light bulbs to fluorescents or LEDs. Choose renewable power. Ask your utility provider about renewable power and make the switch. Eat smart. Buy local, organically grown foods decrease your waste, help reduce the toxic gases being produced in landfills, start a compost bin and recycle, change your commute, walk, cycle, or even transit wherever you can, support and donate. There are many organizations such as the David Suzuki Foundation working to solve the climate change problem. Find an organization and get involved. The planet will continue to suffer at the hands of climate change until we do our part.